My bad. Ugh. All right. A great way to learn how to do many egg-related activities is by hands-on learning. The same goes for many other classrooms as well. More classes would bring more hands-on learning into the into their classrooms, and I think students would focus better. Um, the animal learning lab, which is what I'm talking about, um, research showed that approximately 36 percent of students are kinesthetic learners. Make it easier; it make it easier to have labs and clean up afterwards because it's pretty much like a hose down facility. You don't have to worry about getting something wet that shouldn't be. According to the superintendent, providing a second second classroom for the ag department, which is pretty much what it would be, because there'd be desk and everything in there. According, to, uh, I'm not, um, you could also use it for community members as well if they wanted to host meetings. Like apparently the cattlemen have thought about that. Um, this would be the, the location that they finally decided to put it, which is right out at the south end of the faculty parking lot. They thought about putting it up on the top, on top of the hill, but for the, uh, what is it? The American Disability Act, you have to have a ramp, which for every one inch of rise, you have to have one foot of ramp, because you technically would have to have a ramp to go up there, even though you couldn't just drive around on the road. So yeah, that equals up to like, over 200 feet of ramp, which I think is a lot of concrete. Mm -hmm. um, also, they'd have to put in like a lift kit, I think she said it is, a pump thing for the sewage and everything for water to get it up there. So that's why they chose this. Down here, you are limited to a 36 foot by 48 foot building, which they, if they were gonna put it up on top of the hill, they were going to make it larger so we could take the aquaponics system out of the greenhouse, put it in that building, so then we could utilize the whole greenhouse again. And during the winter, you wouldn't have to keep it heated because it takes a lot to heat that because there's no insulation. Um, also, having it down here, there's already paved access to it trailers so if it rains it's easier to drop off animals because there's not mud or anything it's a lot closer to the school better supervision because if you have rabbits or chickens we're talking about just having those cages outside cameras can watch this a lot better down here than they can up there it's a lot harder for someone to do something down here than up there where it's gravel road right beside it Um, the facility would give students exposure to animals that they may not have been around because some people haven't been around cows or anything. Um, it's pretty much not a thing of you obviously have to major in animal science or something, but it just gives you the exposure so it gives you more ideas. And they've also, with that being another like facility kind of, they've talked about maybe adding a second teacher to the department, but that's still kind of in the, don't quite know yet. Um, also, you could learn about the food production and safety. The United States, United States has one of the safest foods. Pretty much you may think, oh, food poisoning. Well, other countries are a lot worse than we are, and a lot of the a lot of the people that get sick is from like imported meat, not from our own country. Also, there in the facility you could show how AIing is done. Um, she's talking about getting like an ultrasound thing for which you could check for pregnancy or the carcass. And in conclusion, you have listened to what I have said. Now that you can make your own opinion on the lab, and if you think that hands-on is a better way to learn, I'm going to end with a quote from Ms. Fleming. We know that this facility isn't going to make every student want to major in animal science careers, but we will give more students exposure to animals and hopefully allow them to become agriculture advocates 
because not everything you see on TV is true.